Hey YouTube, it's Sabrina. Um, today's video is going to be based on um, a car crash that happened at 4 a.m. this morning. Three lives were lost. This happened in um, San Fernando, Trinidad. Uh, there were six people involved in the accident. Three of them are dead. Three of them are still in the hospital um, in critical condition facing their injuries. Um, first off, to name off... Uh, there was this guy named Derek, this girl, Kanisha, um, Anthony Balkasun, who was the driver, and the three girls who died from the accident are uh, two twin sisters um, named Kadija and Kurtima Taylor, and the other girl's name is Kaija, no, Kafaya Gill. Kafaya Gill. Um, Kafaya was 19 and the two twins were 18. Uh, like I said, this happened around 4 a.m. this morning. Um, it's crazy though, as I was awake at that time. The reason I decided to do this video was because about a week ago I was on Facebook and I liked this picture. And, you know, if it's a picture on Facebook, you know, that, you know, I really like, sometimes I'll read the comments, you know, if, if it's like, you know, one of those random, say it's, you know, mostly the pictures with the random sayings, the funny sayings, or, you know, the pictures with captions or whatever. So I like this picture, and I started reading through the comments. Tell me why, I, uh, one of the comments, you know, the name got my attention. Um, uh, the last name got worse, I... Gill or some shit like that. Whatever. La the name got my attention pretty much. And you know, usually I just read the comments, but this name got my attention. And then the name was Kafaya Gill. Tell me why a week later she dies in a car accident. The only reason I know it's the same girl is because I've seen her Facebook because I went back to the I looked up the picture on Facebook um, and I went to the, her Facebook and connected you know the comment with the Facebook and the information based on what I know about the girl from the a accident and turns out it's the same girl so when she wrote that comment that I saw she was still alive this girl was still alive, and for some reason her comment got my attention, but this girl was still alive. Now, a week later, she's died in a car accident, and I'm like, whoa. Like, life is, like, that was, life is crazy. And it makes you not want to take your life for granted. When you see somebody, you know, who had life, you don't even know they're across the world. But you see, read a comment that they wrote. You know, where it says, oh, X amount hours ago, this person wrote this comment. Then a week later, I and mean, then this girl dies in a crash, and then you put two and two together, and you're like, whoa. Like, shit really does happen. Just because that doesn't happen to you doesn't mean it won't. <laughs> so I just, that's one of the main reasons why I'm making this video is because I found that really odd and strange and crazy, you know. That who would know that I would come across that a week before this girl gets into a car accident. And it's just, it blows my mind. It really does. It blows my mind that, you know, I even found out about the car accident, let alone, you know, that I actually seen the girl's uh, comment from on Facebook when she was still alive. It just blows my mind. But, um, anyway, uh, I told you the names of the girls. The two twins. Like I said, their names were Kad, Kad, Kadja, Kajaya, Kadija, I don't know how you say that one girl's name, and Kurtima, 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 and Kad, Kadja. K Kadija, there we go. Kadija and Kurtima Taylor were the twins. And the other girl that I was just talking about, um, right, you know, that I said I'd seen her comment on Facebook, 
was named Kafaya Gill. And I'm about to show you a picture of the twins that they took. This was a picture they took about an hour or two before the accident. Um, this was taken at the club they were at because when they were when they got in the accident, they were on their way home from a birthday party at this club. So this is the last picture we have of the twins before they died. And it was taken about an hour or two before the car accident, before they even left the club. So here it is. Here are the two twins. Those are the girls. So sad. Yep, those are the girls. Okay, and then the other girl, Kafaya. Um, this is what she looks like. And I realized that the media is really stressing the fact that the twins died. They're really stressing the fact that the twins died, but they're, you know, they're not putting pictures of this girl who also died in the articles. I'm seeing articles, you know, twins die in crash or twins lives are taken or something like that. But they'll mention this girl in the article, but they are not, um, they're not, you know, showing pictures. If you find pictures, it's on Google. You have to Google, uh, you know, who the girl was. For me, I, you know, I made that connection from Facebook. But, you know, as far as articles, they're stressing the fact, you know, that the beautiful twins died. And, you know, it's so tragic that, you know, they're brought in this world and taken out of this world together. But, you know, they're not, you know, not giving this girl anything for the fact that she's dead, too. And it wasn't just the twins. She died, too. Her life was lost too. Just because she didn't have a twin doesn't make her any less of a person. She died in that crash too. Um. Anyway. Oh snap. Anyway. Um. I'm about to read you the article real quick. This is from um. The Trinidad. Trinidad. By the way these girls were in Trinidad uh. San Fernando, Trinidad. Uh, San Fernando, Trinidad is where they died. Um, but this is uh, this article is from Trinidad Express newspapers. Um, okay, it says twins die in crash. It says friend also killed. Three others in critical condition. It says twin sisters Ka Kadija and Kurtima Taylor were among three persons killed in a car crash on Sunday. The 18-year-old sisters and four friends were returning home from a nightclub in San Fernando. Police said the driver, Anthony Balcassoon, was driving his white Mazda 3 car along the San Fernando Bypass Road when he lost control at around 4 a.m. The car flipped several times and landed between the pillars of a concrete bridge near the cross-crossing interchange. The twins of Jack Street and Marabella died at the scene. Supposedly their heads, their heads were like, they died on impact and supposedly their heads were on the roadway. So they say, I don't know why they got to make it all dramatic. It's bad enough that it's, you know, tragic they're dead. Anyway, um, they died, died at the scene. Kafaya Gill, 19, died at the San Fernando General Hospital. She basically died on the operating table. They tried to save her, so, you know, even though the twins were, you know, practically already dead on the scene, they tried to save the other girl, but she still died. She died at the hospital. They tried to save her, but they couldn't. Uh, anyway, it says the, uh, the driver, 20-year-old Balcassoon, and two others are listed in critical condition. The Taylors were six foreign pupils at the St. Covenant, St. Joseph Convent, San Fernando. Um, Gill, um, Kafaya Gill of Pleasantville was a University of the West Indies graduate. graduate. Relatives said she began working at the Southwest Regional Health Authority a month ago. You know, sad though too is the twins were supposed to take this exam. I guess to get out of high school or whatever they were in the school they're in because I don't know how the education works out there. Um, they were supposed to uh, write write their exam to get their, their completion or whatever they get for completing uh, their education. 
they are supposed to do their exam this next week and they're never going to live to see to write it because of what happened. Um, Balkasun lives at Concord Road located within Petrotrin's refinery compound at Point A Pier. Police are investigating whether speed and alcohol tr contributed to the crash. I guess you could say this is a lesson. Do not drink and drive if, you know, alcohol was involved. Me, I won't go anywhere with someone who's been drinking. I won't go anywhere with them in, if they're behind a wheel. I won't do it. I always drive, I will always drive with a designated driver because I'm not going to try to end up in an article like this, you know. And... I'm sure they probably had a couple of drinks. I'm positive they probably had a couple of drinks. So it was a birthday party, but, you know, at this club. But, you, you know, who knows? They're doing the autopsies today. They're supposed to be doing the autopsies. And anyway, I might keep you guys posted on it if, you know, I keep, if I have time. Because I'm doing a work assessment this week. So I just uh, came across this on Facebook. Uh, my friend Jocelyn, she, um liked a link or something or liked a photo or a page she liked a page that was what she liked a page and I looked at it and I was like hmm this is really sad you know and then you know I you know looked at a few articles and you know saw the names and then I put that connection with the girl one girl's Facebook I was like well but anyway, my condolences and prayers go out to the families. They're going through a rough time, especially the twins. You know, because she lost not only one daughter, but she lost two of them, the only daughter she had. Um, rest in peace, you know, girls. That's all I gotta say. Rest in peace to uh, Kadija and um, Kafaya and Kartima. So, Kadija and Kartima Taylor and Kafaya Gill. Rest in peace to them. And I, you know, my condolences go out to the families because they're going through a rough time. They had a candle lighting and a prayer thing for the girls at around 7, 8, or 9. I don't remember. It was within those three hour periods. They had a little prayer light, lighting candle thing for the girls. Um in San Fernando where the accident happened and you know hopefully they you know find some stuff on you know what caused the accident and what exactly happened um and I hope the other people who are in the accident get better um the ones who are at the hospital recovering I hope they heal you know and try to live life on the best that they can after what happened so, with that being said, likes, comments, dislikes, dislikes are all welcome below. And I say this in every video. I want your guys' input on this. Tell me what you think about, you know, this topic and what happened and what, you know, what you think has taught you, you know. Um, as far as that, you can, um, shoot. Uh, you guys could look it up on Google. Just Google it. Twins die in crash or uh, twins die in car accident. You know, and there's, it should come up. Um, or you could just write Trinidad d twins die in crash and it should come up on Google. If you would like to, you know, do some more research on it. You know, if I haven't really, if you don't think I've ha made an accurate um, summary of the situation. Anyway. Um, that is a likes, comments, dislikes are all welcome below, and I want your guys' input on this, I really do, so, um, with that being said, I, I, will, I shall see you guys next week, YouTube, and I'm not sure what the next week's topic is, I never do, I just, you know, find ones and go from there, but I shall see you guys next week, and... Hopefully I can give you an update on this if I've heard anything or seen anything. Give you an update on this as well as next week's topic. So I will see you guys later. Peace out YouTube.